get right to our top story. We're here in the ABC 7 Alert Center following breaking news. 39 people have died in a fire at a Juarez migrant facility. The National Institute of Migration has confirmed it happened at the National Migration Institute near the Stanton Bridge port of entry. It's where we find Good Morning El Paso's Michael Courier. Good morning. Good morning, Hillary. I'm live right now at the Port of Entry for the Stanton Bridge. And the, the facility is right across the Stanton Bridge to the right of it. And you can see cars are starting to make its way through. Here's a look at video our ABC7 crews captured of the scene last night as 68 adult men from Central and South America were housed in the facility, majority coming from Venezuela, according to the Institute. Now, 29 more migrants were injured by the fire and were transferred in serious condition to four local hospitals for immediate attention. The fire began in a facility in the men's area that was reported by employees who work at the facility. Overnight, many emergency services responded to the area around 10 to 10.30 p.m. and units of the fire department, state civil protection, the Mexican Red Cross, and the rescue department were on the scene. The Army, the fire department, and the National Guard have gradually left as they clear the area to make way for forensic medical services. And because of the facility being near the Stanton Bridge, that may a a affect traffic this morning. But you can see that vehicles are starting to move its way through in and out of the port of entry. But we will continue to update you on this story online and on air. But for now, live from the Stanton Bridge, Michael Courier, ABC7.